Hi guys! Oh my god, I can't believe it's time for this video. Please ignore how dirty my apartment is. I cleaned out my closet, as you'll see in a video, and that's just the stuff I'm donating, so just everything's all over the place. But as you can obviously tell from the title of this video, I am getting a dog. Oh my God, I'm, I can't believe I get to finally tell you guys. Oh my God, I'm so excited. I actually kind of teased it a couple weeks ago on my Instagram, I was doing a Q&A and someone was like, will you ever get a pup of your own? And at that point I knew I was, but I like did a poll of what if you guys think that I should. I just kind of wanted to gauge the audience's um, vibe and every, it was like 87% said yes okay the sirens can you calm down this is a big moment in my life anyway i'm getting a dog she is a girl king charles cavalier spaniel and i'm naming her magno i mean she's a girl cavalier king charles cavalier spaniel and she's all ruby and i'm gonna be naming her magnolia um, I'm so excited. I've been wanting a dog for so long, but I never really thought I would do it. I thought like maybe I was too young or like not capable. But then when Claudia got Theo, I like really picked up the slack with that. And I like knew, I started to see like what it would take. And it was just something that I knew I could do. Like I just am destined to be a dog mom and I've always known that. So I'm just so excited. Also, this is the perfect time for me to get a puppy and train her because I really don't have anything else to do. But focus all my time on her, which is exactly what she would need. She is so freaking cute. I literally cannot wait to get her. Like she's just, she's just going to change my life. Like I, I'm just so excited. I got basically everything that I need for her as of like right now, obviously things will come up, but I need to kind of get everything set up because I'm going away for the weekend. So is Nicole. And once I get back, I'll have her. I'm so excited. And this is my dog, it is not Nicole's. I've been asking Nicole to get a dog, like for the, like our, us to share a dog for like, as long as we've lived here. Like when we moved into this apartment, I like asked the management, I was like, can we have dogs? Because like I was planning on at some point getting a dog. Um, and she just doesn't want one of her own, but she's like happy to have a dog around. Like she has to be like, she gets to do what I was doing with Theo. She gets all the love and the affection, but she doesn't get to do the hard work. So for her, it's best case scenario. So I just can't believe like Magnolia is just like gonna be here. Oh my God. She's so cute. I can't wait for you guys to see her. Okay, so I have to get everything basically just set up. I need to like get the crate set up, all that stuff. So that once she is here, everything is good to go as much as possible. And yeah, I can't believe I'm finally making this video. Okay. All right. Let's get this show on the road. Okay, now that that's done, yeah, I worked out in between, whatever. I'm going to show you some of the other things that I've gotten to prepare for her arrival. So, obviously, puppy food. And all this, like, um, I asked my trainer and my vet. I'm not just going by the skin of my teeth. I'm doing my research. I got a harness in pink, obviously, but I also got a collar just in case. This is too big, which it shouldn't be a snack too small, but you never know because they're so small when they're puppy. So, this should fit. I think I can make it smaller even leash and then oh this her food her food look how cute love it then I got measuring cups so I make sure I'm getting her the right amount doggy bags I feel like I'm missing something oh and then I have so much more stuff on the way like her toys 
cleaning supplies, just all that fun stuff. And yeah, so that's like my little haul of things that I've gotten pre-Magnolia, and I'm sure it's just only gonna get more, but I'm just trying to be as best prepared as possible. I'm so fucking excited. I should probably open this. Oh my God, it's so cute. I'm just so excited for everything to just be like pink. This is the same one Theo has too, so like I'm used to it, so that's nice. Wait, I'm so excited Theo's gonna have a cousin. This is, has to fit her. Actually, I don't know, but I, I think so. I think it will. Oh my God, it's so cute. I could die. They didn't actually have a matching thing. I was kind of annoyed about that. Cause like they had this, but these are two different pinks. Actually, maybe I should have gotten that leash, whatever. It was $5, so maybe I'll get another one because this one looks a little thin. But anywho, that is my little haul. And then I'll be back when I get her, when I pick her up. I'll vlog the whole thing. Oh my god, I'm so excited. I hope you guys are excited for me. I feel like people are going to be like, some people are going to be like, it's so much work. I'm aware I've done my fucking research. And it's. It's the work that I want. I know I can do it, and I know that I have the ability to do it, and I just think it's gonna be great all around, so let's try and be supportive. Nicole, yeah, we're gonna see <laughs> if Nicole can fit. It's real small. Oh man, your booty. You cannot fit, literally, like, at all. <laughs> no way. What is, oh, it's a comfy bed? Ugh. That's good. Oh, man. <laughs> you really were like, yeah. Okay, it's 7.30 in the morning, and we're on our way. Ooh. <laughs> Don't sound so excited. <laughs> to meet Magnolia. <gasps> woot, woot. Okay, we got her. She's a little scared, but she's gonna have a happy life. Happy life. Hi guys, okay, so we've been home for a few hours now. Say hi, Maggie. Um, and I just like can't stop crying. Every time I look at her, I just cry. She had a little accident, she peed, but you know, we're gonna excuse it today. It's, it's, it's a confusing day for her. Um, took her outside on the leash. She like really didn't like it, but we will figure it out. And I'm trying to crate train her, obviously. But she's crying in the crate. It's just like, it's too much for my heart to handle. But I know that these are the things that I have to do. I have the trainer coming tomorrow. So I will show some of that. Um, and yeah, and she's just so cute. We're just sitting here listening to Taylor Swift. I'm gonna feed her soon and then take her out again and hope she goes to the bathroom outside. Nicole has arrived. She's met Mags. Hi. Do you love your you love your little family? Do you? <laughs> she peed outside twice because she's such a good girl. Oh. Here, say hi. Your new roommate. Oh. Hmm? Am I getting it? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so cute. Oh my god, she's, she's like, so yeah, she's we're like bonding. Yeah. <laughs> No worries, she's crying again because look at her. <laughs> I can't even tell you how many times we like have been watching TV and we're like, imagine if there was just a dog right here. And no, <laughs> she is. Right here. Right here. <laughs> I can't. 
Okay, I'm showered, which I didn't know if you could shower with a puppy, but you know, Nicole watched her for the two seconds I showered. I did accidentally wash my hair with body wash, but it, this isn't really about me. She took a fat nap today and then we had dinner and she just chilled. Like she didn't even try to eat our dinner. And then I gave her dinner and then I took her for a walk and she peed outside twice. And now we're just gonna chill and read. And then I'm gonna walk her again in a couple hours and we'll see how it goes. I am kind of scared for the nighttime cause everyone was like, you're not gonna sleep. And I'm sure she's gonna be like whimpering in the crate. So that should be um, interesting. However, looking forward to it. And the sirens that Magnolia is gonna have to get used to. She loves, oh my God, oh. <gasps> she like loves to just like put herself in places that are just don't make sense. Also, people wanted me to address why I named her Magnolia. Um, I always loved the name and then we were going through names and one of my sisters, I think it was Claudia, like said Magnolia and I loved it. And then literally right after I was like really thinking hard about it, Brett Eldridge released his album and the song Magnolia is on it and it became my favorite song. And then I was like, this is a sign. So then Magnolia it is. And yeah, it really just came pretty naturally. Hi, it's Sunday night, 10 PM. And we're gonna, oh, well, I'm gonna walk her at like midnight and then put her in her crate and hopefully she sleeps through the night but she's getting acclimated to the bed now i think she likes it though you like the silk sheets i thought you would she woke me up at 7 45 it's okay but I put her in my crate lot in the crate last night and she cried for like 20 minutes and then I thought we were good and then she was like crying at like for like like 30 minutes later for like an hour or so I put her in my bed oh man that I would take her out because she's being quiet, right? So that's what I'm, I want you to do during the day, right? Okay. Ignore her for a few, um, then you can give her like a nice little tab of the crate or uh-uh or a term, no. Just make sure like you're not saying Magnolia, no, right? Yeah. Um, just say no, right? Yes. And then if it's at nighttime, what you're gonna do is you're probably gonna do the firm no not giving her too much time to okay. like cry right. because obviously it's late. You don't want to upset the neighbors, right? What is this? Come on here. Your heart is so big. It's an extra small. Oh, for now, anything you get her is going to be big. Yeah, right? Yeah. But like as long as it's not coming off, it's it's fine, I think. I mean, it should be okay. Maybe on the street you just have to be. Yes, queen. Yes. She's never peed that fast ever. Yes. Good job. So one of the things I actually use for mouthing is playing tug, right? right. So so well, you're well. not gonna let him. You're not gonna let her um, actually swallow the right? Rope, right? Um, you're, what you're gonna want to do is you're gonna. So the toy, you know, she's gonna smile it, she's gonna be interested in it, but until you start doing this, she doesn't care, she that, doesn't much. care that much, right? So eventually, <laughs> you're, you're gonna wanna have, make sure she has a grip on it, right? And tuck to it a little bit. And then you're gonna wanna freeze for a little bit, right? Not let it move. Yes, good girl. So though, but you see the fact that she like looks for these tiny little spaces. Right. What I say, like when we make the crate smaller, she might have an easier time. Better, right? Because like she literally, like yeah. when we were sleeping, like she had to be up against me. Like, Can you look at this. I mean, she's rich. her whole head thing in this thing. <laughs> oh my god. You. Oh my god. Look at her face. Wait. Pick her up. You have to look at her face. Oh, all full of crumbs. You're so cute. <laughs> you have to eat just like your mom. Yes. All right. So. I'm gonna make pretend that she's a pro at this, right? Okay. I'm gonna say, Magnolia, sit. 
Sophia has no attention. <gasps> yes. Good girl. So Good she did girl. it, and I almost gave it to her, but then she did this. Yeah. So I stopped myself from giving it to her. Kind of did like, ah, uh, pause, and then she did the right thing. Then she got it, right? Good girl. So that was a really good example because I did not have her focus at all, right? Um, and that's normal because she just doesn't know yet to sit well enough, right? Um, what happens is if you tell her to sit and she doesn't do it until the third time, then she's gonna be like, well, I don't have to do it until she tells me three times, right? right so right. what you're really doing is you're teaching them a delayed response. What we really want from her is for me to say the word once and for her to immediately do it, right? Okay. So I think if I'm about to go into her crib, I'm gonna have to get her to do it on her own. Right. Yes! Good girl. So since she went in her crate by herself, right. I rewarded her. Okay. And then I just so, put the the water? Yeah. After she's done with the food, you're the one, you don't want her to like that. Ah, so red. I love you. Go to your crate. Yes. Sit. Yes. Good girl. See <laughs> her sense of yeah. get out. It's so funny. Yes. <laughs> Okay guys, me and my crazy hair are gonna end this video here. Me and Mags are chilling. She just took such a heavy nap in her crate and was so good. The crate was too big, so um, the trainer like used the divider to make it smaller. And she just peed and pooped outside in under five minutes and she is just a genius. So thank you for following along and I can't wait for you guys to see the rest of our lives together. So I love you. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Um, I love you guys. Please subscribe to my channel and I'll see you next week.